until it actually escapes. There are some dogs that can, and, and we, and including our roads, they pedal and they get on it, but they don't really turn it. And and Tillman, when he gets on it, he he turns, he <laughs> he he actually flips the board around and goes the other way. So it's it's unbelievable what he. He, yeah, he does ollies and all that. He, he's amazing, and I tell you, he he lives for the skateboard. I mean, you, you don't have to really work with him. I mean, you see him down there. All he wants is his board, and uh, it's amazing. And how all this started was uh, I went to the Rose Parade one year in L.A. Never had been before. I was a native. Went to the Rose Parade. Saw the Rose Parade. How interesting it is. Then about three months later, I saw Tillman on TV. And I said, I want to find that dog, and I want to put him on a Rose Parade float. So I did that, and the first year we did it, the Rose Parade did not give us an award, which I was kind of perturbed about. I, I thought I, we deserved the award. It didn't matter that we had wood and plexiglass on our float, and we were supposed to have flowers. We had a skateboarding bulldog. But they brought me in, and they said, and they did give me an award in January, and said no company in the 119-year history of the Rose Parade ever got that much press. And thank you. And we got two billion media impressions off that first float. So, and that's when Tillman skateboarded. The second year, we set the record for the world's longest float, and we had Tillman and five of his friends I snowboard. The, same the third year, we set yep. the record uh, for the world's heaviest float, and uh, again, Tillman and his friends, and that was five billion media impressions. Last year, Tillman surfed with Norman on the float. And that was uh, 7.9 billion media impressions because we had Ford put the engine in and Ford put it everywhere that they powered the world's heaviest float. So it was terrific. So what's transpired out of Tillman and the Rose Parade, Tillman has his own bus, which he travels around the country in. He's been on tons and tons of TV shows. He has his own TV show, which was Who Let the Dogs on Animal Planet. Uh, the show is going to come back in October again. Yay! And he's amazing. So, anyway, Sorry. so here's the, the one and only, the world's fastest skateboarding bulldog. That's Ron Davis, his trainer down there. And let's see him skate. All right. <laughs> Where'd he go? That is too funny for the cat bar. <laughs> it was very funny. We were in Florida on the beach and it, uh, you know, there's, a, there's like a concrete strip. Some, luckily he was a cool kid, 19 years old, he was skateboarding, and, and Ron wasn't, there he goes.